the truth of the matter is that you don't need to be tribalized. You understand? Tribalism eh, is what we hear it from our illiterate fathers who was not privileged to work in banks. You understand? Who was not privileged to work in companies owned by an individual? Okay, let's take for instance, an Igbo man own a bank and the branch is in Yoruba land and Yoruba people are working there. And you are using the money to train your children and still teaching them tribalism. Education should be should expose our mind. Education should expose that mind. That is why when you see as an NYC student, why are you not being sent to your side? They want you to mingle with people, relationship, so that at least what our father do not know, we should teach them. But if our father is still the one, what they taught us then is still what is passing through us, that means we don't know what we are doing. For us to build this nation, we must take away tribalism. We should know that we are educated. Our father who told us this story, he was not educated. There was no connection or bond. English language connect us together. An outside man who can speak English means can understand you. During these days, there was nothing like one language that can bring us together. So a Yoruba man was not understanding what an Igbo man is saying. An Igbo man was not understanding what a, a, a Yoruba man was saying. So they thought they were accusing themselves. You know, when we are sitting together as a crew, probably 20 of uh, you guys, then theory of uh, Igbo, you understand me? When I speak Yoruba in that means, they will think I'm like, you understand? There was no connectivity. Let us not be monkey. 